Hello guys, Vortex City back here with another Mac tutorial and today I will be showing you how you can move the dock and hide it. So what you're going to want to do is head over to the settings or system preferences, whatever you prefer. Then here on the top row you're just going to hit the dock and right here you're going to see the position on the screen. This essentially controls where the dock is located on your home screen. So if you choose the bottom, it moves to the bottom. And if you choose the right, it moves to the right, just like that. So you can have it on the bottom, left, or right, wherever you want. Sadly, you can't have it on the top, although that would be weird as it might interrupt other buttons up there. So you got left, bottom, or right. I normally keep it on the left just because it conserves space uh, on your desktop. And then, of course, if you want to hide the dock because it's annoying when you're doing other things and you want to have that extra screen real estate, all you have to do is hit this button where it says automatically hide and show the dock. Right there, I'm just going to click it and it's gone. But of course, if you want it back, you can just put your cursor right over on the side and the dock comes back up. If you put your cursor on the bottom, nothing comes. But if you choose bottom and you put your cursor there, then the dock will come on the bottom. I'm going to keep mine on the left. You can keep it wherever you want. It's all personal preference. So with that, I'm Vortex City, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Remember to subscribe if you aren't already, and I'll see you in the next one.